Okay, today I'm going to be showing you some self-pouring liquid. So this liquid I have here, it's called polyethylene glycol. It has a molecular weight of about a million. Compare that to water that has a molecular weight of about 18. So normally what happens if you pour a liquid out like water, you start pouring, you tilt it back up, it stops. It stays about the same level. It obviously doesn't keep pouring out when you pour it. That's because all of the little water molecules, all the little H2O molecules, they're not really linked together because they're so small. So as soon as you stop pouring, these molecules down here can't pull any other ones out. But polyethylene glycol has a much higher molecular weight. So it has very, very, very long chains of molecules on here and they're all mixed together like spaghetti in there. And it still just looks like a liquid, but on the molecular scale, there's very long chains of molecules in there all linked together. And so what that does is if you pour the liquid, the liquid that has already come out starts pulling the other liquid out and it just keeps pulling it and it essentially pours itself. Okay, I'm gonna tilt it a little, get it started. It should just pull itself out after that. There we go. <laughs> That's so cool. <laughs> so even if you just barely pour it, it just keeps coming out. Look at that. Just up and over the end of it. So the other cool thing that happens with polyethylene glycol is if you spin a stick in it, it climbs the stick. <laughs> See how it came up? See how high it's getting? Climbing up. <laughs> Made it all the way to the top there. <laughs> so another reason you might have heard of polyethylene glycol is because it's also a laxative. So gotta make sure I don't drink any of this. So the consistency of this stuff is just like mucus. It's really weird to handle. So normally this stuff is just clear, but I put blue food coloring in it so you could see it better. Hey everyone, thanks for watching again. I hope you liked this video. If you did, let me know in the comment section. Leave me a like on the video. And you can comment with what you'd like to see me do next time. And if you're not subscribed yet, consider subscribing for more awesomeness in the future. And I'll see you next time.